<sighs> Alright, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we got a... I don't even know what year this thing is. I believe it's like a O... <clears throat> like a 08 or 09. Uh, Toyota Avalon. Let me get my light. Snap on light, you did. You know, yeah. Good stuff. <clears throat> All right, so today we did the the um. Hold on, let me set my light up. Today we did the belt tensioner. All right, there you see it's all clear silver. I put it in already, but I'm gonna just show you guys the step to do it. The steps. So first things you want to do is of course take the belt off. I'm gonna take the belt off first. Tensioner is right here, obviously. So I'm gonna take the belt off, and then what I did, I came around, and that's the um, the AC compressor. AC compressor, you gotta take off the four screws. There's two at the bottom, two at the top. Take off your plugs. There's one plug right there, another plug right there you can see it I and mean, there's another plug at the top there's three plugs take off those three plugs take the AC compressor out and I didn't have to take it all the way off I just turned it upwards sideways and put it right here in this corner but before you do that because you have to take out the um you have to take out the uh, the alternator has to come out too so what you want to do is after you take the compressor off take the four bolts out and move it out of the way there's oh, you can't really see it uh, let me see if you can see it. Let me try to zoom in. Okay, that's the, that's one of the alternator screws right there. I'm trying to focus on it so you guys can see. Right there. You got one alternator screw right here that you want to take out. And then, once you, once you remove the, uh, the AC compressor, there's going to be another screw on the back that you have to pull out. You want to take that screw out of the back, and then you can go to the top. Let me let this down so I can show you guys from the top. Alright, so after you take those two screws off the bottom, you have one screw at the top right there. This one screw. You will have to take it out, just unloosen it about two or three revolutions. And then the whole alternator will just flip up. You flip the alternator up. And I'm going to show you why you got to flip it up. Okay. Oh shoot, left my flashlight. Okay, so back to where I was. Once you take the compressor off, you want to turn it, right now it's what? Horizontal, you want to turn it vertical. Turn it vertical, and it should sit right here in this corner right here. It is sit right here in the corner where the, uh, where the block is. Right in here, it'll just sit there. And if you do it the right way, the actual, um, the fans will hold it in place. So once you move it, there's going to be five bolts in here. There's five screws. One, two, two on the other side, and there's one at the top. That's the reason that you have to move the alternator out of the way so that you can get that one at the top. So there's five screws on there. After you take those five screws off, it comes right out easy. Very easy. And I'm gonna go get the old one so I can just show you guys how it looks so you can know where the five screws are. <laughs> Alright, so uh, this is the old one. Five screws. It sits like this. It sits like this. See, there's one, two, three. Four and five at the top. This top one is the reason that you have to take out the alternator, or at least move the alternator out of the way so that you can get to it. Otherwise, you're gonna be fighting with yourself for all day for no reason. You don't want to have to do that. It's really not worth it. Oh, my camera's getting wet. 
but yeah, so uh, we also changed the um, the other pulley on here, the idler pulley, which is very simple too. Let me show you guys. Obviously, you got to take the belt off. This pulley right here, the black one. It's one fourteen millimeter, and on here, these are all fourteen millimeters too. To take out the uh, to take out the AC compressor, there's four twelve millimeter screws, and everything else is fourteens for here. And yeah, it comes right out, pops back in. Nothing hard. Oops. Very simple. But yeah, that's it for you guys today. Yeah. Uh, just something simple. I'm gonna try to. I'm trying to post every day from now on. So, you know, I want to get more content for you guys. And also, I got a new camera. I don't know if you guys can tell, but Woo! got a very good camera. I got the uh, Canon SL2, so I can have more and better content for you guys to look at. So yeah, you guys like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what y'all want to see next. And yeah. I'll be back with another one.